Nick, where's the wow, fucking garbage? Wow, squat is garbage. Get out. Is that how my platoon wants to go out? Do they want to go out saying, we're not going to win this, man? Because, you know, when I play Battlefield, you know, sometimes I say stuff like that, but I'm always trying to play my hardest. Like, I don't know. <laughs> I have my doubts, but I try not to. Whenever I play, I always try to go for that win. I always try to go for that W. But in competitive games, I never rage quit. I stay until the very end. And you never know what's going to happen. There's still a bunch of time in this game. We have one objective to defend. They got the other one. What do you guys do in situations like this? Do you give up? Or do you play your hardest until the end? Fellas, this is a last stand. We had to hold these fools right here and right now. We couldn't let these fools get past us. During this whole game, we were getting curb stomped. Every single one of us, one by one. Our heads were just getting bashed into the ground. You know, this PTFO Friday, we played the INC clan. Um, we had another clan war, 12 on 12 PTFO versus, you know, PTFO versus INC. And, you know, these fools, they were pretty good. And out of the, out of the 10 matches we played, we came out on top six times. They got the best of us four times. But, I mean, it, these, these games were fun, man. And... Out of every loss, I've kind of learned something new, you know, just how to adapt to certain situations. But most of our losses that night was because of unorganization, confusion, you know, just, just basic stuff like that. You just got to keep your head in the game, and, you know, you just can't lose that thought, you know. Out of every victory, you just can't keep getting ahead of yourself, because that can happen you know you get ahead of yourself and you'll get greedy and then you'll lose it happens it happens to everyone so you know I've said this before number one tip in Battlefield 3 don't get greedy number one tip in Call of Duty don't get greedy <laughs> greed is the number one way to die greed is the number one way to lose in any game you play trust me trust me but, again, these fools put up a great fight. Shout out to all of them. Shout out to the INC crew. Shout out to everyone who stayed in the lobbies and the games that night. But one, one, one really bad thing about holding, this fool, holding these fools down on the last base is that 
it's just complete darkness. I mean, the what you're seeing on the screen right now is how I was playing it. I couldn't see Jack. And they couldn't see me either unless their brightness was turned all the way up. But I'm pretty sure at this moment our team is inspired to win this. And the other team is the other team is hungry for a win at this moment. The other team is hungry. Alright, they're gonna try to get this victory. They're gonna try. But as a team, are we gonna let them do that? They're pushing up with tanks. Infantry on the right side. They're trying to flank us. We can't let that happen. We need some AT weapons. We gotta take out their tanks. We can't let them push up. We gotta send our men up. We can't let them flank around us. We can't let them fly their helicopters over in our areas. The Z-11s and the little birds are flying into our caves. We can't let that happen. If you see that happening on this map, get in it. Because you don't want the other team to jack it. Even if you're inside a cave. Trust me. <laughs> I've taken out a tank in here before. With the Z-11 and a little bird. So, Fellas. Just keep your head in the game when um, you're in competitive matches. And you see these fools get a plan off at like the last second. And this is where we start. Everyone on our team just kind of starts freaking out. And are we going to let him win? No. Hell no. They're down to one ticket. Their immortality is over. I'll get that last kill. This is your boy. PTFO Friday. I'm out.